This is YesFM Stupid News. You know, to, to want to do this and, and actually look at spending the money to, to do this, she must have had several drinks. Um, Not a question in my mind. She wasn't just tipsy, as they describe her. She had to have been uh-huh. like borderline blackout drunk to do this. A woman in Manchester, England, was mm. out celebrating a fan's birthday party, drinking. Mm. They started doing shots of double pink gins and Sambuca. Then she decided she was going to get a taxi and drive to the Ukraine to help with the efforts there. Uh-huh. She got it reached out to Uber. They estimated it would cost about 6000 bucks. Uh-huh. But she was turned down because her bank account had insufficient funds to cover the $6,000 Uber ride. Yeah. Uber tried to take the money nine times uh-huh. and said none of them were successfully done. And yeah. uh, they were investigating to see yeah. what happened and if the woman's okay. Yeah. <laughs> drive me to the Ukraine. I will help. That, that'll take days. Days and can you imagine, like, when you wake up? Because, you know, you're going to pass out in a car ride like that. Wake up. Where are we going? What are we doing? And I spent how much money? Exactly. Oh. All right. Then you got this guy. He's doing dishes. All of a sudden, a naked woman comes into his house and takes his shotgun. Um. Yeah. So this woman is accused of breaking into her neighbor's home. She's uh-huh. 57 years old. Uh, she was totally naked, uh-huh. stole a shotgun, then barricaded herself inside of her own home. Yeah. The neighbor says that he was just washing dishes when all of a sudden the woman was walking towards his back door. Sans clothing. Uh huh. And then he looked up again, heard the door shut, and saw her walking away with his shotgun. Yeah. And then he says, She told him, It's my house when he asked what she was doing. Eventually, right. she was taken into custody and treated yeah. for self inflicted sword wounds. Sword wounds. So apparently, yeah. their shotgun was step two. I don't know. 